No, oh uh, yeah, this is happening. Ah, wait! I hope I can do this battle again. This is such a fun battle. So if I'm not able to do this again, I'm gonna be very sad. I think you can do it again, but... Oh God, oh God, he's a God! Come on. Oh my god! Did you simply move Wait. faster? Or did you leak the information regarding the golden house to me on purpose? No matter. Look at my and the nose is over now. I'm red! Take it! Okay, yeah, no, I was kind of busted. One with my boy. From whence you came. Oh god, he's gonna come back. That's our key test. Yo, he kinda got me, no more. A minor error. Enhanced animal mark. Oh. Swift and merciful. One with my boy. So I can get him here. What? Absorption test. Subscribe and hit that bell notification. Yeah, I'm gonna need it. A touch of frost. Absorption test. Animal test. Spirit wing. Attack. Oh god. Now one of those. Oh! I was nearly dead. Okay, I'm back to green again. No one else is dying. Go. When she this thing runs out, I can be shown you. So his one out. So I can use Noel. No! Oh my god, I can't use Noel. Well. Absorption test. Uh, uh, Stay clear. Absorption test. Okay. Someone needs assistance. One with my blade. Swift and merciful. Yeah. That is like. 
That's crazy. I can't have Submit for judgment. Chi <sighs> Chi! Chi Chi, come on! You got this girl! Woo! <sighs> Well then, time to cool off. It seems the burden of the foul legacy transformation was too great for my body. I lacked the opportunity to think this through. And now that I consider the matter more carefully, you never had any chance of beating me to the Gnosis. You had no connection to the Gnosis, no matter where it had been taken. That's what we've been trying to tell you! We didn't take it! Your show of ability today far surpasses that of Senora's initial assessment of- You already know the answer, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. But oh, if that I is a secret it. you wish to keep, I guess I'll just have to curb my curiosity. I guess what's basically just gonna happen this is- This battle has already left me satisfied. But Anyone who strives as I do to grow stronger shall be called a friend. Even if our friendship can only be shown in battle against one another. Pretty sure that's not the normal way to make friends. Unfortunately, I must bring this amiable conversation to an end. My quest still beckons. Given that the Gnosis wasn't taken by anyone, then we must look once again to the beginning. Perhaps it was never in the Exuvia to begin with. In fact, it might be that the Exuvia was just a diversion of sorts. What? So you mean that... Yes, it appears so. Interesting to say the least. It seems that the guardian deity of the capital of commerce is also well versed in little maneuvers beyond the boundaries of contracts. As such, we must now look to our backup plan. Backup plan? No! I had hoped it would never come to this, for the weak will be swept away in the process. The truth is, the world belongs to those who pursue strength. I seldom willingly involve myself with the weak. Unfortunately, we cannot be picky about our methods as Fatui Harbingers. Children must all learn to eat their vegetables sometime. So what are you planning to do? I will awaken the god that lies dormant beneath Guyan's stone forest. A god? Osile, overlord of the Vortex who was defeated by Morax, the Geo Archon, in the Archon War, and who has remained pinned beneath the waves by the Geo Archon's stone spears ever since. If such an ancient god would be unleashed upon Liyue Harbor, defenseless without the protection of its deity, do you think the cunning Rex Lapis would just stand aloof and watch the ensuing destruction? But the Archon War ended 2,000 years ago! How can an ancient god appear in a world now overseen by the Seven? Simple. I've already prepared the means to awaken it. Hey! Those are sigils of permission! Oh, Paimon remembers now. The Fatui have been researching them! Indeed. The one that was given to you was just a byproduct of our research. With the power of so many sigils of permission concentrated in one place, Along with that which was bestowed upon me as a harbinger by our Tsaritsa, breaking the subduing might of the Geo Archon spears for a time should be no obstacle. Using the powers of ancient gods in such a situation fails to interest me and is largely against my principles. But knowing that such an action will not only force the Geo Archon to show its hand, but you as well, that makes matters a little more intriguing. Let's see. Will the nation that has lost its deity be swallowed up by an ancient malice once more? If you wish to drown together with the people of Lyra, you're free to stay and enjoy the show. Huh? He's... he's already gone! That guy is fast! Uh, what's going on? Did she 
with the calamity of such magnitude. We have agreed to put our differences aside for now and unite against this common enemy. <laughs> oh, Paimon gets it. So how do you yeah. plan to defend Leon? <laughs> Just seeing this overlord of the Vortex guy puts a pit in Paimon's tummy, even from all the way out here. It's not just you. We've got new Millilith recruits who can't even stand at attention without shaking. The force of an ancient god's presence seems to be too much for ordinary people to handle. Which is why we must stop that monster before it gets any closer to Liyue Harbor. So the Archon War was fought 2,000 years ago against enemies like that thing? Now that's scary. <sighs> So will the power of the Chi-Sing, Millilith, and Adepti gathered here be enough to stop that god? We've already discussed this together, and our conclusion is... not necessarily. What? Uh, Wait, all of you uh, are supposed to be the guardians of Lilith. Can't you think of something? One certainly could. Huh? The Chi Sing did once research the matter of the Guizhong Ballista when it piqued their fancy. And as fate would have it, one who did craft the Guizhong Ballista with one's own hands is here. For what could you mortals ever learn of Adepti mechanisms? Yet, it would take one but a little tinkering to turn this Ballista into an engine of war beyond your wildest thoughts. <laughs> I suppose this is one blessing from the Adepti that we should be thankful for. So be it. We shall use the upgraded Guizhong Ballista to fight off that god. All the Adepti here can lend their strength to man it. We haven't a moment to spare. Our battle begins now. Yep. What the? What? Oh! What is she? He was Ning Guan Du. What? What is Ming Guan doing? What? Oh! Am I recording? Yeah. Thank God I'm recording. Oh ha! Are those turrets? Yo, 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 yo! Oh, the Fatui are coming. The Fatui! They're attacking the Glacial Ballista! <laughs> the Ching! Let's go! I'm about to pull up the Ching. You know, what do you mean I ate my capture? I already am trying to pull up I guess you're gonna get a free trial of Ching, I guess. The three Adepti are manning the Glacial Ballista. Do not let the Fatui disturb their work! All able Millilith, with me! Let's go help too! We Adepti have not faced a god in several millennia. Oh, Fryl was one extra good. You are made of then. What strength remains within you? One wishes to witness. No, you, come over here. Swirl, my Back go. Forth, my boy. Sacred name, fortune preserver. He's still frozen. 
Divine power. I am very familiar. Be careful not to get hit. Someone needs assistance. The Fatui! Their attacks are unrelenting! Huh. How daring. Snedgnai's diplomats will answer for this afterward. Every last one. Oh, get the whips! Of the death dietrix. Animal hypostasis emulation. They're gonna attack this. Got attacking again. There are so many victories too. We kill them. <laughs> Were you about to say we can't hold them, children? Huh? Don't lose heart. Here, take this. This is... Adeptal energy! That light from your body! It's like the time in Julian Cars! Wow! It's Madame Ping's shockwave! This granny's really strong! and fight with all your might. I too did this during the Archon War. <sighs> so this is what Ganyu's like in a fight. My name means swiftness. Take my power and run as I do. Three forms of adeptal energy at once. This will hurt a little. Please bear with us. Once you've adapted, try to use them in battle. Tinkles is back alive, baby! Tinkles is back alive! Woo! And if you don't believe, just why? Woo! Oh my god, this is so hype! I don't believe it does Very quick. Absorption test. Wheel of life. Yo, no matter. It is the most useful. Yo. Hurt her junk crits. No, no. As a dude can make it. Trying to get me riding dirty. Trying to get me riding dirty. Trying to get me riding dirty. Exercise caution! I fear that the god's power has reached its peak! In other words, if we hold here, there's nothing worse to come, right? Oh god, no, that shoot. Oh, Mark, shoot! Stay clear! Uh, 
Careful now. The Guizhong Ballista is destroyed. Huh? Without its covering fire, retaliation shall be difficult. But the Jade Chamber is our last line of defense. We can't give another inch, no matter what. Come on. I have another idea. Uh, what do you mean, Lady Ningguang? I'll sacrifice the Jade Chamber. What is the meaning of this? I understand. Traveler, lend me a oh, hand. It's Farewell, a little friend. Goodbye oh. for now. Let us meet again in the future. Huh? Oh. Grenade, let's go. I did it. Oh, no, this is bad. No, I, it's not. It's not. I'm about to sing the song. I'm about to sing the song. I'm about to sing the song. Grenade, let's go. I did it. And you, and you. I hate you. Resonate me too. Woo! Yo, that's sick, baby! <laughs> and Levi's still fine! No, kind of. Oh, some stuff's been damaged, but. Oh, no. Where's Ningguan? Where's Ningguan? Is it finally over? The ominous aura of that monster has indeed begun to fade. Begun. The effects of the sigil of permission last but a short time. It will be some time before the Overlord of the Vortex can make any waves again. We are indebted to you for your assistance. If the Adepti hadn't happened to be here, the future of Liyua Harbor would surely have been in great jeopardy. Save your flattery. We didn't just happen to be here. Surely you won't pretend to have forgotten the reason for which we came. Come now. There's no need for such harsh words, Cloud Retainer. I've heard that when Ningguang began learning to do business, she had already started setting aside part of her then limited income in preparation for building the Jade Chamber. At first, it was only the size of a small room, but with continued expansion, it has become the palace that lies before you now. 
It is a testament to Ningguang's entire life, both as a businesswoman and as the backbone of the Liu Qixing. Seeing the Jade Chamber destroyed in the defense of Liu means much to her. To me, such cooperation and sacrifice deserves at least some recognition, don't you agree? Well, I was really hoping you would say that such sacrifice could at least be used as some leverage in our negotiations. <laughs> Thank you all for hearing me out. We know very well why the Adepti came here today. But please forgive us. We cannot yield to your wishes. Oh? 3,700 years. According to our records, the Adepti signed a contract with Rex Lapis to protect Liyue 3,700 years ago. Even to this very day, Liyue and its lands have stood the test of time, immovable as stone, just as it was thousands of years before. This is truly no small feat. But yeah. that does not mean that the Liyue of today is the same city as it was all those years ago. Do not merely cast your protective gaze upon the land. Instead, focus your sights on our city and each of the citizens that dwell within it. Are you questioning our means of protecting Liyue? Hmm. I mean no offense. I simply hope that our Adepti forebearers would see Liyue in a new light. <laughs> forebearers, you say? One doubts you would be fit to be part of such a lineage. This morning, Rex Lapis appeared to me in a dream. What? In the dream, I yearn to tell him that we Chi Sing, though mortal, are equally bound to the contract. Each passing generation of the Chi Sing leaves many things of value to be inherited by the next generation. I also thought to tell him how the past generations of Chi Sing had strove under his rule to survive in our mortal world, establishing a network of contracts which has since come to be known as trade. But I dared not speak. I could only gaze at him in silence until the moment I awoke. Oh, Ningguang! Yet another perspective. What are you trying to say, Outlander? Right! That's something that happened in Mondstadt. It's a story about the Four Winds and the people of the Animal Archon. The Animal Archon sought to quell the strife between the two Each of the Seven Nations. Though your point is the very height, as Adepti, we've become a... All right, all right. Didn't Ningguang suggest... I apologize for appearing in full armor. I am afraid I cannot show the proper courtesies. And who are you? I am Feng Yan, a sergeant of the Millilith. I have come to extend my thanks to the Adepti. I thought this battle would perhaps be my last. But thanks to the aid of the Adepti, our forces were not as bad. Although I am a mere mortal soldier. Hmm. <laughs> Why does everyone look so down? Didn't we just beat that big monster? <laughs> Weren't you frightened? I wasn't afraid. All the strong Millilith guards were there. When danger is near, thanks for protecting me, a harp. Unfortunately, we wouldn't be able to participate. Huh? Because we are Adepti. Oh, okay. It must be hard being an Adeptus. Aww. You see, this is what Liyue is like today. The country of contracts is grateful I... to the Adept, although their blood is weak. The time of contracts between... Hmm. Seeing the... Your line of inquiry is... Hmm. Seems like the... Let us return now. Eager to leave, conqueror of demons. <laughs> yes, one understands what the Conqueror of Demons means. But one fears that by the time one finally grasps the new contracts of Liyue, you humans would have once again changed the place beyond recognition. Fair enough. <sighs> Since we Adepti have consensus, 
then one shall persist no f But how will we ensure that the Liyue Qixing will not simply exploit their power? <laughs> All right, Moon Carver, you... <sighs> Looks like the... Oh, right! It's nice that we've got peace and all, but we're forgetting one thing. Child wanted to unleash the god so he could lure Rex Lapis out. But we were able to handle the overlord of the Vortex on our own. So Rex Lapis never showed up. Oh, and speaking of that, don't we still need to get to the bottom of that Archon's death, too? Hyman doesn't get it. But isn't the strongest lead we have the Adeptilus Rite of Parting that we're organizing? No idea where Jean Lee's going. Let's ask for him at <sighs> Wang Shem Funeral Parlor. <coughs> but I'm just gonna keep recording because yeah. <laughs> the adventurous. Oh, it's AR30. <sighs> huh? AR30? No one told me I was AR30. Okay, faster. <sighs> faster? Okay, faster. I ride on wind and cloud alike. Is there anything I can do for you two? I'm afraid that Wangsheng Funeral Parlor isn't in the best state to receive guests. We've come to see Zhang Li. Could you please tell him we're here? Unfortunately, Zhang Li isn't here at the moment. It seems he went to Northland Bank. Doesn't the Northland Bank belong to the Fatui? Last time we saw Zhang Li was before we went to the Golden House. I want to go to the Golden Do you House think again. he doesn't know about the attack on Liyue? Visiting the Fatui at a time like this could only mean more trouble. We had better go and make sure. Yeah, but uh, if there's no. Do that There's no battle. pure form of water. Oh, AR thirty five. It can aid us greatly in the purging of evil. AR thirty five. I could wait. 
Air 35, okay, I can wait. Everyone will be saved, but it is safe. If I die, then I might just cry. If I cry, I might just sigh. But that's gonna be for today's video. Make sure if you if you like the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that button notification so I can post more videos. Bye.